Oh, it's Friday, June 18th, and Megan, today's show is dedicated to uh, celebrating Juneteenth, and I assume uh, this was recorded prior to uh, Juneteenth being made a federal holiday. I'm not sure. Um, but, uh, you know, <laughs> Congress just passed the bill to, to make Juneteenth a federal holiday. Um, but the GOP all across the nation is uh, trying to get um, African-American history uh, erased from uh, elementary and, and middle school uh, curriculum. Um, they're using uh, the concept of critical race theory to dog whistle all of the uh, GOP and conservative um, racists because they don't clearly know what critical race theory is. I was glad to see that was discussed for a hot second, um, that it is really um, uh, uh, something from uh, a legal theory that is taught um, in, or is born from uh, legal studies uh, about systemic racism. Um, but the morons of the GOP are using it as an excuse to say, we don't wanna teach about the history of black people in this country. Um, and you had said a few weeks ago that you were very interested in the uh, 1619 Project and you'd like to do a whole episode just on that. And now here we have an episode uh, that's dedicated to uh, Juneteenth, um, which has just made a federal holiday. And I guess maybe you don't really want to bring it up and talk about it because you know that the GOP is trying to erase black history from... Uh, being taught to school children. Um, but instead of talking anything topical about um, the history of African Americans in this country, you ask your two guests about um, cancel culture and infrastructure. So that's just great. Um, more, you know, of you learning this year so much uh, about listening to other people's experiences. Um, so I also have to assume that this was recorded before the big dust up with Whoopi. I don't know why I'm assuming that. I just do. Although you did look kind of constipated through the whole thing, which was a little bit weird. Um, and then you fangirled in front of Gene Smart like a moron. So that's about it. That was your day today. Uh, at least on television. Um, I guess we'll be back next week and we'll, uh, we may be back on location again then. Let's find out.